are highlighting some new technology for the material handling industry, specifically uh, equipment for mobile applications. So compact motion control in low voltage, 24 to 48 volts. And so we're highlighting some of this technology that you can see here, both the compact motion, but also very compact controls. So this is an IP67 industrial PC where we can have the PLC for say, shuttles of an automated storage and retrieval system, autonomous mobile robots, automated guided vehicles. This is also a very ideal product for this type of mobile technology because companies might have a whole fleet of mobile uh, types of equipment. And here they can design their own custom board with commercial off the shelf IOs and servo technology. Again, from 24 to 48 volts. And with this mobile technology, one of the key uh, importance is safety. So having the operators or the associates operate around these mobile devices. And that's a key benefit for Beckhoff in this compact motion control. We can meet up to a category four PLE safety. We can pull in analog safety. So the encoder of the, the wheels on a mobile device can also be compared with the actual speed. So we can control the speed in a safe way. And then finally, part of our compact motion also includes our motor driven roller controller card. So here we have motor driven rollers by separate manufacturers, both being controlled by the Beckhoff MDR controller. And we have a very unique technology with this hybrid cable that connects the MDR controller. And that technology combines the Ethercat communication, power for the motor rollers, and a separate power circuit for the electronics, the Ethercat communication, and the inputs for other IOs on the system. It's very important because conveyor now has to abide by the NFPA 79. And if you have an e-stop for the conveyor, then it would have to be a category zero or category one stop. And thus you'd have to drop power to the motor rollers. And if you don't have this separation of power, which we support, you'd end up uh, dropping power to your communication, to your electronics, and all of your input data coming back that's giving you status of the system. So it's very important to have this unique hybrid cable with the separation of power meeting the NFPA 79.